can pray, you can avert the incident that I saw. There is an incident that I saw in the air. I don't want to speak a lot of detail. You know an incident which involves human lives. On the 24th of December 2016, during a Saturday service at Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries, the servant of God, Pastor Eindlow, gave a prophecy about a thick cloud he saw covering Bedbridge. He mentioned that there would be an event that will shake Bedbridge and make it the focus of media attention. These were his words. The next message is as follows. Let us pray for Bedbridge. In a vision, I saw a thick cloud moving in the sky. It briefly covered Bedbridge. This means that there is an event which shall shake Bedbridge and the and make it Bite preach the focus of media attention. Let us watch and pray. So we need to pray for that place called Pine Bridge, part of Zimbabwe. Hallelujah. We need to pray for Pine Bridge. I don't know what exactly will take place there, but I saw a very thick cloud covering Pine Bridge. So we need to pray for Pine Bridge. Hallelujah. On the 27th of December 2016, Property worth thousands of dollars was destroyed when a Zimbabwe Revenue Authority warehouse caught fire at Bedbridge border post. This event has been reported in major local news media as it was accurately prophesied by God's servant, Pastor Einlo. Let us pray for Pine Bridge. In a vision, I saw a thick cloud moving in the sky. It briefly covered Pine Bridge. This means that there is an event which shall shake Pine Bridge and the and make it Pine Bridge the focus of media attention. Let us watch and pray. So we need to pray for that place called Pine Bridge, part of Zimbabwe. Hallelujah. We need to pray for Pine Bridge. I don't know what exactly will take place, but I saw a very thick cloud covering Pine Bridge. So we need to pray for Pine Bridge. Hallelujah. The servant of God, Pastor Angel, urges saints and intercessors the world over to continue to pray for Pine Bridge and the nation of Zimbabwe. May the Almighty God bless you. <laughs>